Hello, everyone, welcome back to HegoSpot. Have you ever met the trouble of forgetting your passcode, and then your iPad is inaccessible because you forgot your password? And after trying several times with wrong passcode, your iPad is locked. At the same time, you will see the message iPad is disabled or iPad unavailable appearing on your iPad screen. At such time, the only way to unlock your iPad is to factory reset your iPad. But it should be noted that resetting your iPad can get rid of the passcode restriction, but it will also delete your iPad's data. But this is inevitable. If you already understand these precautions, then this video will introduce several ways to reset your disabled iPad without using iTunes. The first method is using Erase iPad feature to factory reset your iPad. It doesn't need a computer to assist, so, it's a quite convenient option for erasing your iPad. Erase iPad is a feature that comes with the iPad when it is upgraded to iOS 15.2 or later. But if you want to use this way to reset your disabled iPad without iTunes, here are some prerequisites that need to be met. First, your iPad is running with iOS 15.2 or later version. And you should remember your Apple ID and password linked to your iPad. Besides, your disabled iPad should have a stable internet connection. Keep entering the wrong passcode multiple times on your iPad when you see iPad unavailable or security lockout on the screen, tap on the erase iPad option at the bottom of the screen. Then, tap erase iPad again in the bottom right corner of the screen for confirmation. Next, enter your Apple ID and password to sign out of the account. Once the iPad has successfully confirmed your identity, the process of resetting the iPad will begin automatically. And an Apple logo and a white progress bar will appear on your iPad screen. When the reset process is finished, your iPad will restart. Then you can follow the prompts to reset your iPad. If you have a backup of your iPad data on your computer or iCloud, when you come to the app and data step, you can restore your deleted data here. If you are looking for a safe and reliable tool to factory reset your iPad without iTunes, iPhone Unlocker is here for you. This is an amazing tool specially designed to solve the passcode problem of iOS devices, including screen passcode, screen time passcode, Apple ID. If you forget the passcode of your iPad or iPhone, then iPhone Unlocker can be one of the best solutions for you. It's easy to fix in just a few steps. Download and install the software on your computer. And you can see the download link at the video introduction part. Connect your iPad to your computer with a USB cable and launch iPhone Unlocker. Select White Passcode from the menu and hit Start Next. Then, you should make your iPad detected by the software. Click the Device Connected But Not Recognized link and follow the guide to put your iPad into recovery mode. Now you need to confirm the information of your iPad. In Device Category, you should select iPad option. After the confirmation, hit the Start button beneath. Later a relative iOS software will start downloading for your iPad. The process might take some minutes to complete. Once done, a warning box appears saying the tool will erase all the contents and update your iPad to the latest iOS version. For unlock confirmation, enter 0000 and click unlock. The device unlocking process will be initiated and last for several minutes. Make sure your iPad is connected to the computer during the whole process. When the reset process is complete, your iPad will reboot and you will be able to access your iPad again without a passcode.
The last way you can reset your disabled iPad is to use Find My function in iCloud. iCloud not only has the ability to locate a lost iPad or iPhone, it can also remotely delete your iOS device. Before proceeding, make sure that your disabled iPad has enabled Find My function and has a stable internet connection in advance. Go to iCloud.com and sign in with your Apple ID. Once you've signed in, click Find My in the bottom left corner of the page. On the next page, select All Devices at the top of the screen, then choose your disabled iPad from the list of devices to reset it. Click Erase iPad in a pop-up window to factory reset your iPad. Then click Erase in the next pop-up window to confirm, and the process of resetting your iPad to factory setting will begin. When you forget your iPad passcode, you can use these three methods to reset your disabled iPad quickly. Hope these three methods can solve your troubles. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and learn more about how to unlock iPad. Thanks for watching.